Hi there, I'm Tom Morgan, Microsoft MVP and Community Reporter at Microsoft Ignite 2019. Um, I'm joined today by Stade. Stade, I'll, I'll let you introduce yourself. Hello, my name is uh, Stade Hansen. I'm a MVP for 10 years and uh, I'll be, I have been speaking at uh, Ignite uh, all those years. I think the first one was in 2015. Right, yeah, absolutely. And so you're doing a session um, at Ignite this year. What's your session on? So I have a session uh, together with my MVP colleague, uh, Morten Hellebro. We are going to show you in 20 minutes how to deploy an SPC in Azure, because it's a useful feature if you want to bring your own zip trunk into Microsoft Teams, uh, but also for those countries that don't have calling plans. This is the only option to bring your zip trunk and telephony into Teams. And also, um, it's a really great way to uh, have a cloud-only solution. It's the first time you actually can do that with telephony uh, uh, with your own trunk. So I'm really looking forward to that. So in 20 minutes, 20 working minutes. SPC. Wow. Yeah, Fantastic. live, live. Live in 20 minutes. <laughs> yeah. No, no, no risks there at all. No pressure, no <laughs> risk. What no could pressure. go wrong, right? Awesome. That sounds, like <laughs> that sounds awesome. Um, now, I know because we were just chatting before this, You've got some tips for, for attendees, so some Ignite tips. So um, you said you had seven. Is that, yeah, is that right? I, did, I did a brain dump. I did yeah, a brain dump amazing. on, on some happened. tips. Yeah, okay. so um, I, I started with three tips, and then I was like, oh, here's four more. So <laughs> okay. let's, let's go through uh, them. So. OK, first tip, number one, uh, be early at the sessions you want to go to. And I not, don't think mean like uh, five minutes early or seven minutes early like 20 minutes early, 15 minutes early, because there's so many people attending. And if it's a popular session, it will fill up really quick. Mm -hmm. So if it's a session you really want to go to, you should really be there. Make sure you are there super early. That's a good idea. Yeah, definitely. OK. Yep. And uh, number two, it's on Lando, dress in layers. So uh, have a hoodie, have a sweater, have a T-shirt. It's super cold inside. Uh, especially in some sessions, it could be super freezing. It could be under the vent. Make sure you bring clothes. But outside is hot. Even though it's November, Orlando is hot. So dress in layers. Yep. Uh, yep. And bring your bring your backpack uh, with some water as well, uh, because it's going to be a lot of walking. Um, I I, ra I, um, I go out on around twenty thousand steps. So wow. like bring shoes you want to walk with. Yep. And uh, for the whole day and evening and the next morning and the day and evening and next morning and the day and evening. Um, yep. yeah, yeah, so, yeah. yep. Yeah, that's, that's uh, really good. The shoes, definitely. Uh, and the, yeah, the layers is really good advice because the, the air con is, is pretty, um, pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> um, so regarding uh, all the walking, uh, invest in a step counter, right? Mm -hmm. So you can like uh, capitalize on that, like uh, make sure that you monitor it. Good idea. And then put it on social media so everyone knows how many steps you're doing. Yes, live feed it on social yep. media so like you get some kickback for it as well. <laughs> yep. um, and then um, make sure you go to the your favorite tech booth, especially during social hours, because there will be a lot of MEPs there, a lot of subject matter experts, a lot of Microsoft people there. You are bound to get your questions answered, or you may share with some really cool people, or, or maybe meet your idols. I don't know. Yeah, definitely. That's such good advice. Like, bring your hard questions um, to there because that's the, the, all the speakers, all the Microsoft people. They basically have to be there during those those tech hours and those those, those social hours. So, yeah, yeah, that, that's where you I can know, find them. I know typically I uh, gravitate around like the Teams uh, mm -hmm. booths, and I see a lot of older MEPs like gravitate around there. I'll just walk over and I see a lot of people I know and and want to know. Um, so yeah, use the tech booths. Definitely. Um, uh, and, but, and during but, the com conference, um, use OneNote to capture because OneNote now have uh, Office Lens. So the first thing you, you open OneNote, take that first picture with the Office Lens technology, and then you type subsequent pictures as well and notes in the same notebook and make sure it's a notebook stored in OneDrive. So it's uh, stored in the cloud. Uh, in So that way you can have uh, some really good um, notes when you come back. Yeah, that's really good advice. I do, I do that. I take photos on my phone, um, but I also have my laptop open. So I write my notes and they just sync. It's the same one note. So the photos just come in, the notes come in. It's, it's really, it works really well. Yep. yep. So the last one, 
Mm -hmm. uh, start using to do to take uh, like quick notes during um, the event. You will get a lot of tips. You will get a lot of um, see a lot of tweets. You will see a lot of uh, news. You will see a lot of blog posts that you don't have time to read right then and there. So send them to to do or you can also send them to OneNote uh, to make sure you find them again after a conference because you will see so much information and you have don't have time to process everything. So you need to find it again after and um, check out my one of life hacks videos as well, especially on setting this up on a mobile phone, the Android uh, mm -hmm. and um, uh, for OneNote mobile as well. Fantastic. I'll get a link from you and I'll, I'll put that in the uh, in the tweet for, and in the notes for the video. Brilliant. Yep. Excellent. Those well, are my tips. Excellent. <laughs> awesome tips. They're really good. No, that's that's awesome. Um, so you can find Starlace um, session. You can find it in the session builder. Um, I'll put a link to that as well. And you can find you can find him um, around the Teams booth. So you can ask, bring all your hard questions. And Definitely. if you want an SPC and you've got 20 minutes, then you should also do that. Brilliant. Starlace, thanks so much. That's super useful. Um, and see you at Ignite. See you.